friends, USD here. Welcome to a new Raid Shadow Legends video. So I'm back from another business trip and we're opening secret charts today for Oystrid Fusion. It's almost done now and I changed my mind and decided to do it. Probably a bad idea because I needed the rest. But let's hope maybe we'll mess up the skills of like, what's his name? Will Cox, Willix, something. Yeah, it's also a very good chance because it's a 2x, 10x for with this guy. Yeah. The new guy. Can I even find him? Okay. Is he secret order, not banner lord? Yes, he's with Venus. Yeah. So Falmond uh, Mourn Sword. He's really good in arena, very similar to sort of UDK build when you want him. Very slow because of his passives, uh, like uh, protecting him from damage if everybody else takes turns. The faction is. unity aspect that they started releasing with some of those champs is cool, is good. The champs are good. They are not OP, they are not broken, but still good. And it's 2x anyway, so let's see what we'll get. I haven't checked Mercy, but we're only opening six sacreds on each account to get the points needed for the summon rush. And then I'll just... Uh, pad them up with Benji from the first chart. Well, not much there. I'll pad the sacred, the six sacreds up with some greens or ancients because I have some saved. Okay, okay. That's actually not a bad pull. So Gwendolyn is niche. She's not like a super OP Lego that will be used everywhere. Um, increase accuracy and block buffs, and then AOE's three turn cooldown. 100% chance of decrease speed, leash, and decrease accuracy. That can be good in many places. Will she be immediately built on my account? Probably not. But yeah, let's see. And I think I have a high level soul for her. Yeah, I got a five star soul for her. So let's see. Second chart. Well, sacred from, well, a legendary from the second chart. Good luck there. So yeah, we still have four to go on this account before moving to the other one. Sashi, no, not that good. Okay. Noble is the worst ever. I think he's used to empower someone. Uh, I have to check. But yeah, probably the worst. Is he used to empower Ninja? Because if so, we're going to use him right now. So, oh, it's not here. It's in Faction Guardians empower champions so we'll see it immediately now yes he's my first novel but he's really that bad what would i gain from empowering my ninja resistance and accuracy good for the dungeon stuff that i'm trying to run him in i don't have a fast team with his in sand devil i'm using the unkillable comp that i showed in a video before um, so yeah, I'll think about it later, but this Lego is so bad that he almost got no use other than empowering Ninja, if you have Ninja, and you haven't been playing long enough to get Ninja, he's just bad, he's just trash, yeah, keep him in the vault, maybe they'll buff him, um, uh, sometime, yeah, Horden, yeah, a horrible epic, so we got two Legos out of six shards, unless we get another one right now, but yeah, so no, Yomitogi or whatever she's called, she's not good. Let's make sure we got the 3k points. And come on, come on. Yeah, so we got the 3k points. We just need to pad them with like 10 ancients or whatever. Um, let's do it right now. Yeah, let's get the points and they move to the other accounts. Other account. We only have one more. That we're doing this on okay nothing crazy here so we got two legos out of six shards i cannot complain about this and we got the points for the fusion so all good let's jump to the other account this lucky account might be taking a break soon because i don't have time to play it enough and though i pulled some crazy champs check the roster there like i didn't get time to build some of the really good champs that i got recently uh from saving and everything check the champs that I have on it. So I have a lot of building to do and because of some clan trouble that we're having, by the way, if you want to join an in-game clan, mid-game clan, an early clan, hit me on Discord. We have the three clans open for everyone. Of course, the in-game clan, our main one, only got a couple of slots open. But we're opening those five sacreds today. 
I'm running low because I'm not hitting clan boss. I'm not playing the account as much as I would like. Uh, I need much more gear farming on this account just to be like, to pay it enough respect with the amount of crazy Legos that we have on it. So yeah, five quick sacred there. Oh, looks like it's going to be too quick. Another Finchy. We didn't get, I'm, I'm not sure where our mercy are is. I'm not sure where our mercy is, but yeah, it's crazy. Come on, give me something good to end the video with. And because I'm running, okay, okay, that was a bad ending. I'm not opening ancients because I'm running quite low uh, on resources on this account, especially uh, shards because I'm not hitting clan boss as I should. So what I will do, I will just pad this up. We have champ training going on right now. So I'll just finish the remaining 1k or 600k points probably if I can count today. Um, so come on. Yeah, so I have like actually my initial calculation. So six, 700k points. I'll just do this with uh, uh, green shards, with mystery shards, feeding champs to each other to get points for the champ training. And that will even help me with the champ training. So that's it for today. Quick and painful as sacred as always are. Thank you for tuning in today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.